Breaking news now. Milwaukee police tonight made an arrest in the stabbing of a Capitol Police officer. Cody Hoyoke live at the scene of 6th and Wells. Cody. Steve and Carol, good evening. Yeah, 25 year old West Dallas man is behind bars tonight, accused of stabbing a 66 year old Capitol Police officer here at the state office building downtown. Milwaukee police spent the better part of the day here collecting evidence and trying to figure out what led to the crime. The police are here to protect us, and the police need protection, so that's, that's sad. When Ebony Cummings tried to go inside the state office building, police turned her away at the door. Officers had locked down the area, processing evidence. I don't know what happened that would provoke somebody to do this to an armed officer, but it's, it must be pretty serious for this to happen. No other state employees were reported injured. Authorities won't shed much light on what happened, only telling us two officers responded to a duress call on the fourth floor. Family members of workers at the lottery office there tell us a man demanded a million dollars and lashed out when he didn't get the money. One officer was stabbed in the neck. The injured officer was taken to the hospital and is currently in stable condition. The officer is recovering. A 25-year-old man from West Dallas is in jail for the crime. It does not appear that this incident was an act of random violence. Investigators are now looking at surveillance footage to see how this could have happened. We will definitely review security of the building, and if we need to have additional officers here, we will definitely do so. Now, I'm told this office building will open for business tomorrow as scheduled. If you have any information that can help investigators call or crack the case, please pick up the phone call Milwaukee Police. Live in downtown Milwaukee, Cody Holyoke, today's TMJ4. All right, Cody, thanks.